Hi there and welcome to another episode of Singing Teacher Reacts. My name is Peter Vox and I'm the director and principal teacher of Vox Singing Academy, which was established in 1993. If we could help you or someone that you know with their singing, we'd be absolutely honoured. We have numerous studios here in Melbourne, Australia, with both male and female teachers. We also give online singing lessons seven days a week worldwide. And if face-to-face -face lessons aren't your thing, please check out the Ultimate Online Singing Course, all in the links below. If you like this channel, give it a thumbs up, click like and subscribe to keep up with other fantastic React videos. And we also have other videos besides React videos, tuition videos, tips and hints regarding singing, live performances from uh, me and, and my, my staff so and students. Check them out. Um, <clears throat> without any further ado, let's get stuck into this. Now, this has been requested. So it's just been a request from Erica Ramos. Erica has pleaded with me to do this, a React video to this. Um, now it is Cancio Dumas and it's by Paolo Gira and Almira Kalimalina. Now I've never heard of them. <laughs> Never heard of them, never seen them. Um, so I'm just going blind straight into this. Never heard it. Let's just get stuck straight into it and, and see see what this is. Obviously two sisters, I'd be saying. I'm just gonna just pause it there just to give you my uh, opinion here. Now, obviously, not obviously, I'm presuming that they are sisters. Um, and this is in uh, a, another language. I'm presuming that it's Russian, I'd be saying. I'm just really getting that from the writing. <clears throat> now, look, absolutely, you know, really great, very, I love the song. I love it. It's very compelling. It's got that nearly folk, classical kind of blend to it with a contemporary twist. And their voices are, are basically doing the same thing. They've got a bit of a folk, traditional sound to their voice then a little bit of a contemporary sound to their voice and a little bit of classical singing in there as well too. So all molded together, which is fitting really, really well with the song and super suits the, the style of the song and, and what they're doing and just really lovely voices. Now, the blonde headed girl uh, to uh, my left, 
I could see had a slightly higher voice, would like to use her middle to higher range more. Um, and the brunette to, to my right hand side really liked to use her lower range more. Both of them had exceptional voices, beautiful tones, absolutely really nice tones. When they were singing, they were really stripped back, so it was it wasn't the whole orchestra. It was so you could really hear their voice. So there was mi minimalistic music, background music when they were singing, which really heightened their voice, and their voice was at the forefront. So you really had to sort of pay attention and listen to it. You were nearly forced to listen to it with this particular song structure and the way the music is crescendoing and decrescendoing through the song. I thought it was great. The microphone technique's great. The tone is great. I don't know what they're singing, and it's and it's captivating. I really love listening to this sort of folky type of uh, music as well too. Um, and, and I really love I love the song. I love how they were um, playing off each other. So they're obviously telling a story between each other. Then they come in and harmonise beautifully together, and and it was just really really nice. Fantastic performance. Got they got great ranges. Um, they can both sing in, in the, as I said, the brunette can sing a lot lower. She's got a lower voice, beautiful, rich voice, but she's also got a very nice high range. Their mouth placement was exceptional. When they were going up higher, they were using the, a beautiful crying technique. They had very nice vibrato, so it was absolutely exceptional here with this performance. Let's keep on, uh, keep on going with this. going to stop it there. So before I stop last time, just after I stopped from the last time, the blonde headed girl did an ad lib. Uh, la -di -da, da -di -da, da -di -da. Uh, and this time the, the brunette girl um, had a chance of doing the same thing. The blonde headed girl did a bit of a lower one, sort of stayed low. And it was really good. I really liked the ad lib, how it sort of changed it up. Um, a little bit of scatting is it's very similar to what they were doing there. Particularly the blonde headed girl was doing a couple of different sort of notes and, and did something that was a little bit different. The brunette sort of sort of stuck very much within the uh, the chord and, and and the and the major notes through here. So she was sort of staying very much in the pocket. But I really like those little ad libs. Uh, there's been two now in the song that have sort of broken it up. Um, so you've had the story. Um, you've had the harmonies together, you've had the, the two ad-libs, and now they're obviously going to go back into uh, a verse each and then possibly finishing with the harmony, I'd be saying. But absolutely fantastic, really enjoying this. She just did the same ad lib as what she did before, which is very similar to yodeling. So it's nearly got a bit of a yodel in there. So this is where this folk sort of aspect comes from. Again, I don't know where this is recorded. I love the backdrop. 
and there's not too much that's distracting people from the actual performance. There's obviously the world there, but there's not too much that's distracting everyone from this particular performance, and I'm, I'm really sort of enjoying this and what's going on. I think it might be from the voice. I've seen like a, a V and then a microphone, so it might be from the Russian voice. Let's keep it going. <clears throat> Wow, yeah, that was that was really, really good. I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed that. I come from a European background myself. Um, so I've grown up with a lot of folk music and folk dancing myself. My heritage is uh, Polish and German. Um, and I really enjoyed that. I loved how it finished there as well too, finishing with a, a light falsetto as well too. So it was a really great song. Started off with the orchestration. They come in very quietly, uh, builds up where they're both singing together, starts down low, uh, goes back into the orchestration. They go back into the, a little ad-lib bridge where they're just ad-libbing some sounds. The blonde-headed girl had two two versions of that and i think she got two versions of of that little bridge because she was doing more so the yodeling and it was a little bit more compelling i really like that yodeling the brunette girl as i said sort of stayed within sort of the notes and sort of kept it quite um safe safe let's just call it safe but it was that was a really great performance i, I really thoroughly enjoyed it now, and even though i didn't know what they were singing it was very emotive and i loved how they played off each other love the harmonies their singing is absolutely fantastic was it they weren't doing anything extraordinary they weren't going up super high or super low um, they did a couple of in and out of falsettos, they did a couple of runs, but they really just kept it in the pocket and really the strength of it was their voice, um, the song uh, and the journey that it took that it took me on. And I really thoroughly enjoyed that and I will definitely listen to more of that again. I really, really, I loved it. It was fantastic. Anyway, I hope that you have enjoyed this reaction. If you have, give it a thumbs up, click like and subscribe to the channel. We've got lots of other great content on this channel. Check it out. Uh, if we could help you or someone that you know with the singing, we'd be absolutely honoured. Check out the links below for more info. We have numerous studios here in Melbourne. We also give online singing lessons seven days a week worldwide. We both have male and female teachers. We also have the ultimate online singing course if face-to-face -face singing lessons aren't your thing. More so... Live each day as if it's your last, live with passion and be good to each other and until the next React video, peace and much love. Bye-bye.